you might have a three wheel combination lock. It might be a TSA lock. You might have arrived in your holiday apartment and forgotten the code. You've looked up YouTube, nothing helps. How do you get in? First of all, I'm going to change the code to something I do not know. I'm not going to look as I'm going to scramble the wheels. Back and forth, back and forth, give it a good shuffle, and then put it back and scramble the wheels again. Scramble, scramble, scramble. Right, let's put all those to zero. Okay, since there's only three wheels, it doesn't actually take long to get through all the combinations or permutations, whatever you want to call it. So we're going to pull up on the shackle and we're just going to go through all the combinations from 0 to 0 upwards. So I'm going to go to 1, 2, 3, and as soon as we get to the right code, this should pop open. So I can actually go quite fast all the way around. Nope. Put that up by a notch all the way around. Nope. Up by one again, all the way along, no, all the way along, keeping constant tension, and I'm just hoping my finger doesn't hurt too much by the time I get this open. Eight, nine. I don't think you have to pull very hard. Okay, zero, zero, and I've tried all, all the second wheel, so I'm going to put the third wheel up by one. All the way around for the first wheel, up by one. All the way around, up by one. And as soon as I get to the right combination, it should open. It doesn't take as long as people think with three wheels. Four wheels takes ages. But with this one, as long as you're consistent, you should be able to get it open. And it might help if you write down where you're up to and take breaks. Writing down where you're up to also helps because um, sometimes you get confused where you're up to or you make a mistake and you know exactly what you've written down where you can um, carry on from. So the third wheel is up to two now. Oops, I think I went right around this one twice as I was talking. And my right hand is starting to feel a little bit crampy. And this is where I would um, write down where I'm up to, take a break, and come back to it. Uh, oh, went all the way around here, so third wheel up by one again. All the way around by one way around. This is one way to try all the combinations. But yeah, with three wheels, some people think it would take all day or hours or whatever, but it should only take a few minutes. The worst thing is if you try all the combinations, it's still not open. <laughs> It'd just be the worst. I'm not speeding up this video because I want to show you how long it would take. And notch this one up again.
We've nearly tried half of all the numbers, believe it or not. And it's open. Okay, so I'll put in the uh, on the screen how long it actually took. We end up having to try about half the numbers. So worst comes to worst, we would have to it would double my time. But as you can see, it doesn't take long. So it pro it's probably quicker than looking up YouTube videos and trying all these different techniques.